A baseball and softball tournament held in Boardman today where teams were hitting the diamond not only to play the game but also to support Poland's Kristen Fox through her recovery. First News reporter Carolyn Sistrand has the story tonight. Baseball and softball teams woke up early on Saturday not only to play the game they love but to support Poland's Kristen Fox. It's overwhelming to be honest with you. Kristen lost both her arms and legs after being hospitalized in March with influenza A. She came home in June after 102 days in the hospital. On Saturday, over 50 teams showed up to the Field of Dreams and Boardman to play for her. And to kick things off, Kristen threw out the first pitch. You know what, sports is a huge part of my family. It's a huge part of their life, so this is awesome to be here to see this. Tournament organizers say they knew the kids were missing out on the opportunity to play this summer, and they had the idea to host the tournament. There, and like I said, with the pandemic, there were some uh, tournaments that were canceled, especially Pennsylvania. So we knew teams were still wanting to play, you know, late in the summers. But they also saw the tournament as an opportunity to help Kristen. Every penny, every penny is going right to the family. This week, Kristen will be standing up for the first time since she was hospitalized back in March, and she will walk to test and adjust her new prosthetic legs. She is scheduled to stay in the hospital for three weeks before heading back home. I'll walk back into the house, and that's what they're most excited about. But ahead of another big milestone in Kristen's recovery, she's enjoying time with her kids, her family, her friends, and her community. I wouldn't get through this without the support of this valley. In Boardman, Carolyn Sistrand, WKBN 27 First News.